Hello people, welcome to a new week. It's so late. I am getting delirious. It took me about, I don't know, 500 hours to pack this. Um, yeah, I should have just packed it in the morning where, when I'm like more awake, but I'll show you what I packed because I did get it together. Um, pistachios over here. This is a peanut butter sandwich. I had to take this bread out of the microwave so it's a little warm and then I put the peanut butter on. It was like melting so I don't know how that's going to hold up. We're going to find out. These are bonitos, like che healthier Cheeto kind of things. Um, some grapes and energy balls. I think all last week I went without putting energy balls in the lunchbox. I'm pretty sure I did. Pat myself on the back for that one. <laughs> but start out this week with energy balls. Um, for Avelina, I'm just packing beans and rice because I'm so fancy over here. That's a Lara bar. Oh, guys. I think last week I showed you that my Amazon package came in with 16 Lara bars. Guess how many are left? The big old goose egg. So we had this one in the fridge, so I'm just going to throw that in there. Can you, like, how did we go through that many? Oh, I know how. Avelina found out where I hid the box. <laughs> And she just grabbed from it all day long. I was like, are you kidding? What a scoundrel. Um, energy balls for her as well and grapes. So we'll see what they eat. All right, people. They came home from school a few hours ago. You know how it is. It's nighttime now. So let's see what they ate. This is Avelina's. Oh, my. That looks gross. Oh, it's just condensation. Um, ooh, look at this. Let's open it. All right. Dang, did I open it? There it is. Ah, she didn't even... Eat any of that. What a punk. All right, that's okay. That might still be good. I can put it on like tacos or something. And here's Eleanor's. Ooh, Eleanor was like excited for me to open this. She's like, you're gonna be so proud of me. I ate a bunch. I mean, she ate, ooh, what's that? A pen, a Shopkin pen? Was this a Shopkin pen? Sure was, look at that. All right, this seems full though. Peanut butter sandwich, nope, she's not a fan. Not a fan of the PB. All right, so uh, here's my dilemma now. I have to pack for tomorrow, but I didn't go grocery shopping. <laughs> oh, I was just planning on going to the store, stopping at the store at some point today just to get some fruit or something, um, but I didn't. So I'm going to have to go dig through the very back of my pantry and see what I've got. I mean, it looks full, but you get, it's not. It's not full in here. What do we have? All right, let me, let me figure this out. <laughs> okay, people, here's what I came up with. Um, I basically laid a bunch of junk out on the counter and I was like, hey kids, come out here and pick what you want. Like, I still haven't even tried these or eaten them. They were inside of a box with other granola bars and I forgot they were there. <gasps> oh my gosh, I know what I'm having for a treat tonight. All right, so, like I said, here's what I packed. Let me tell you guys. Um, these are left over from dinner. They're dinner rolls. I just shoved some salami in there. A chocolate chip cookie. Lara bar. I think this one has artificial sugar in it added. I don't know. I'm going to have to look real quick. Chocolate. Sugar. Yep. Yeah, it does. It sure does. It, it, uh, it has added sugar in it, but still mostly healthy ingredients. Um, I think that's the first time I actually bought those because some of you were like, oh, these are so good. Yeah, of course they are. They have added sugar. Um, I really like the cherry pie ones. And, oh my gosh, guys, they have fall flavors. Pumpkin pie. Oh, I haven't found them yet, but I am hoping next time I go to Target, um, I remember to look for them and that I find them and that they are delicious, of course. Anyway, moving along, um, grapes right there. I'll talk about that in a second. I made popcorn just now because the kids, I put out popcorn and that's what they picked. Um, so this muffin I made earlier, it's kind of like, no, I guess it's okay. Um, I made earlier with Eleanor here. I got this from, uh, Target a while ago. I don't know, a few days ago. But it's pumpkin flax. I haven't seen these before. I buy this kind of um, pancake mix a lot, or I used to buy it a, like every time we would make pancakes until, I don't know, I started getting it at Sam's Club and Costco. Not this kind, but like the biscuit kind. Anyway, short story long. Um, on the back, they have a superfood pumpkin mix. Can you see that? Is it blurry? And um, I decided to make it, so that's what we made. I will tell you that the bottoms are like, I don't know, 
not sticky, but like greasy kind of. And I don't know. I don't know why. And um, they're not. They're well. This one's pretty firm. Not all of them are that firm. I don't know. Anyway, I'm trying to tell you. I probably won't make the muffins again with the mix because I have other like pancake. Not pancake, pumpkin, uh, like pumpkin spice muffin recipes and stuff, but it sure is delicious and the kids really enjoyed it. And it is really fall inspired. Like you smell the cloves and the cinnamon, all spice, all that kind of stuff. So it's delicious. Uh, moving along to Eleanor's lunch, basically the same thing with an RX bar included. This is like one of the kid size ones. Um, yeah, what flavor is that? Berry Blast and then popcorn, muffin, grapes. You know the deal. Let's see what they eat. P.S. Last thing I'm going to say about this pancake mi slash waffle mix slash muffin mix. Um, those That's the nutrition label right there. And then the ingredients. I think they're right there. Yeah. Did I miss them? Is that all it? Yeah, those are. Whoa, it's a long list of ingredients. But um, lots of protein in this. What is it? 15 grams? Holy moly. And a ton of fiber. So lots of protein, lots of fiber. I have been looking for, um, one of my friends came over the other day and she had, um, instead of beef jerky, it was bacon jerky. Oh my gosh. So I've been looking for that for the girls because anything to like keep their bellies full and sustain them throughout the day. I'm always looking for like stuff that's packed with protein and you know, good stuff. Anyway, let's see what they eat. All right, people, let's see what they ate. It is nighttime. Oh, why? Why? Avelina like begged for these last night, and I was like, no, I'm packing one in your lunch. And then this morning, she had one for breakfast. Why? Ah, that's a joke. It's probably bad. Um, oh, what? Did she eat anything? Did she eat anything today? I will tell you, today was Ice Cream Tuesday. What? For real. She did come home, and she ate blueberries. And another one of these sandwiches. And then we had gymnastics. I'm shocked. I'm in shock and awe. Like, the girl barely ate anything. Oh, man. All right. And then Eleanor over here. Let's see how she did. Most of her grapes. And some of that. None of that. <laughs> all right. Well, you know, sometimes it's a good day. Sometimes it's not. And that's all right. I feel that way sometimes. Sometimes you feel like a nut. All right, people, this is what I came up with. And side note, um, Ellen, Avelina came in here for a uh, snack, and she saw her popcorn. She was like, oh, I forgot about my popcorn. And then she also ate her grapes, so none was wasted. Um, I was going to repack her popcorn, but, you know, she is eating it right now. So what I packed for her, I went to Whole Foods today, and I'll show you um, the bags in a second. But at Whole Foods, did you guys know I found the freeze-dried bananas so I normally get these from Trader Joe's they were the same price at Whole Foods but I will say I don't know for certain uh, like ounces and stuff but I think there's less here's the bag I think there's less um, in this bag from Whole Foods than there is at Trader Joe's I could be wrong but that's what it feels like um, but anyway it's just freeze-dried bananas there's nothing else oh look at here Whole Foods has citric acid in it and Trader Joe's does not. It only has bananas. So I like Trader Joe's more and more than I'm talking about it. Um, salami on the same kind of roll as yesterday. I just took it from Eleanor's. And then what is this? A Lara bar. Oh, and this is like open, but it's been in our fridge. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to shove that in there and maybe she'll eat the rest of it. These are peanut butter pretzels. And then these are like healthy star Star, oh my gosh, what are they called? Starburst? Star fruit? Star something. Star fruities. Chewy fruities. What are you guys know what I'm talking about? Anyway, this is supposed to be like an all natural kind. I don't know. Let's see. We can check it out together. <clears throat> Look at the nutrition facts and information. What's here? Can is that focused? Can we look at that, please? Look at that. I don't know. Can you guys read it? I definitely can't. I'm going to have to look at it. I don't know. Okay, so it's definitely still a treat, but it's supposed to be a little healthier. So I only gave them four, and I just tried one. They're definitely more, they're softer than the traditional, whatever they're called, Star Bursts, I think is what they're called. And then for Eleanor, she loves her cheese and crackers. That's Dubliner cheese, same kind of pretzels, and same mush over here. Oh, well, not the same. She's got grapes. I think that's the last All of right, our grapes. people. Let's find out how they did quickly because this camera is about to die on me. Um, ooh, most of those. All right. Good, good, good. I forgot what's in there. Oh, crackers. Okay, so she ate her, oh, her cheese. 
We're missing some compartments. But I'm pretty sure she came home and just started eating stuff. So, whatevs. Oh, yeah. She was trying to tell me that she didn't like the Starburst. She ate one and then gave the rest to her sister, I'm pretty sure, in the car. Did Eleanor give the rest? No, she shared. She shared. Very nice. Okay. And then you ate all of that, whatever was in there. And most of it. Oh, no. You didn't eat your Lara bar. You didn't like it? Did you try it? All right. She only likes the, you know, the coconut chocolate ones yeah yeah i'm the same way okay so i'm gonna pack some stuff for tomorrow we'll see what we can come up with from the bottom of the pantry actually i did go shopping a little bit yesterday so uh we'll see what we can come up with p.s guys i've been watching the hands handmaid's tale oh my gosh i'm dying it's so dark but so good. I couldn't get into it the very first time I watched it. I was like, oh, it's too dark. And then I was like, oh, everyone's telling me it's great. I'm like tilted because I'm leaning on the counter. Um, everyone was telling me how great it was. So I was like, okay, maybe I need to give this show another try. So now I'm like way behind on all of the new shows that are coming out. I haven't seen This Is Us yet. Oh, I can't wait to watch that. The new one just came out last night, but oh, priorities, right? Okay, we have to do life. And then when we have time, we can watch TV. <laughs> All right, people, so this is what I came up with. Um, oranges. Uh, do they have almost the same lunch? I think they do. All right, so here we go. An orange. Um, my husband went to the store today and spent about a million dollars on a bag of these, but it's worth it. The kids are eating them right now, and I'm about to have one as well. Boom, right there. Um, great dessert. So, strawberries, veggie chips, yeah. and then a quesadilla. Quesadilla. Eleanor has the same old stuff. Oh, and always water. It purifies the soul. All right, people, I still have not charged my battery. Um, I also can't believe that it's all, almost, I mean, all, what is the word I'm thinking of? <laughs> okay, guys, I just had to charge my battery finally. Um, I can't believe it's only Thursday. Can you guys believe that? I feel like it's the weekend already. Well, I mean, I don't really feel that way. I think maybe I'm just hoping, wishing that it was the weekend already. Um, I don't know. I know they took some stuff out of their stuff. I don't know. I found these on the floor and whatever. So, <laughs> so they were empty. That's empty. I think they ate everything. And Eleanor was really proud of herself when she, um, when I picked her up, she was like, I had I ate everything. So Avelina ate everything and so did Eleanor. Hallelujah. What did I pack yesterday? I'm going to pack it again today. <laughs> All right. So this is what I came up with. I, I also want to say I picked up uh, the girls from school today and I was feeling Avelina's water bottle because we were walking to the car and it was hot, obviously. So I was like, hey, do you want some water? And I just picked it up out of the side of her backpack and I was like, it doesn't feel like you've had anything. Obviously, it's empty now. But I was like, it doesn't feel like you've had anything. And she said, yeah, I don't drink out of it when it says Eleanor. Oh, what? <laughs> What a scoundrel. I was like, did you drink any water today? She was like, yep, I just went to the water fountain every time. Oh my gosh. she That's my very particular daughter. She's Everything has to be very particular with her. Um, anyway, so this is what I packed for her. Um, a peanut butter sandwich. Oh my gosh. I'm so original, guys. I was like, oh my, I don't, I don't know what I have. Da, da, da. Yada, yada. You guys, do you guys feel that way sometimes? So I bought this for myself to eat, but sometimes you have to sacrifice, right? <laughs> um, I'm giving it to her. Hopefully she enjoys it as much as I would. <laughs> um, she doesn't like the other Lara bars that we have in the pantry. And then this, I made a mistake and I bought these thinking that they were something that they weren't. Where's the box? Oh, I put it away. But um, these are just like more natural gummies. I don't think there's... Oh, I made a mistake, guys. I thought they had like one serving of fruit in them, like the ones that I used to buy that I can't find anywhere anymore. I don't know what happened to them. Maybe no one else bought them. Um, but yeah, anyway, I don't think they have one serving of fruit. They might, though. I'm just going to pretend that they do and move along. I put an orange in there and then some more freeze-dried bananas. Um, Eleanor has the berries. So we bought two cartons of these. And Avelina likes the tart ones, the ones that are like firm and not yet ripe. Do you guys know what I mean? Like the sour ones. Eleanor likes the ones that are ripe, <laughs> so I threw some in for her, and then a peanut butter sandwich for her, um, some veggie chips, an orange, and this is the last pumpkin fiber healthy protein muffin. Um, Avelina just ate one, and I was like, oh, I was going to pack that in your lunch. She was like, no, I'll just eat it now. <laughs> I was like, okay. 
Uh, right before bed. That's great. All right, so let's see what they eat for tomorrow. P.S. I don't know if I mentioned if I said it, but I am also giving Eleanor some gummies too. And some of you might be like, "Oh, that's way too much food for her." But today she came home with nothing. So then, it, in my mind, I'm like, "Oh my gosh, was she still hungry?" You know what I mean? I'd rather pack more than not enough. And I know sometimes I get the comment, "You pack too much." Well, I've got a knuckle sandwich to pack for you. Like I don't care. I'd rather pack too much than not enough. You feel me? <laughs> okay, guys. Um, it is the weekend. Finally, I feel like it took forever to get here. Now that it's here, it's almost over, right? You guys feel that way with weekends? I'm holding a baby, so it's gonna be a little awkward. Oh, a treasure for me. Where did this come from? All right, hold on. All right, so let's see what they ate. Oh my gosh, my nose. Um, ooh, she didn't eat those, so I could save them for another day, maybe for Monday, because I don't plan on going grocery shopping this weekend, and all of that, awesome. Do you guys like to go grocery shopping on the weekends? I sure don't. Whenever I can avoid crowds and lines i do so oh not this what did i pack again peanut butter yeah she doesn't like peanut butter <laughs> i guess we know that now hold on i have to see <coughs> any more all right so that is it for lunches i will say oh my gosh guys yes i watched Grey's anatomy i feel like this should be lunch video slash fall tv talk i watched Grey's anatomy and then, spoiler alert, it's two hours long. I had no idea, so I had to go back, well, obviously, like, go back and watch the rest of it. I thought it was just an hour, and that blew my mind. And then the fact that it was another hour, I was like, oh, my gosh, so much happened. My mind is blowing, of course. Ugh, so much fall TV happening. It's making me happy. But, again, like, it takes up, it consumes so much of my time. Um, anyway. Did you guys enjoy it? What did you guys think? Leave it down below. I love talking about Grey's Anatomy slash This Is Us slash everything TV. Um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And um, I will see you next time, tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Bye.